Hey, this is Lax Rocks Tofu bringing you another NCAA Football 11 commentary bowl. So this time I'm bringing you the Fiesta Bowl. Uh, and it's a day late, so I apologize. But I was like, my day yesterday, real complicated, right? So obviously it's New Year's, so it's National uh, Hangover Day. So wasn't too hot in the morning. Then, you know, wake up and... I'm like, oh, you know, I'm going to go over to a friend's and watch the Rose Bowl. Because, like I've said, Rose Bowl is my favorite bowl. And now I can say it because no one can hate on me if they lost. But TCU was my team in that game. I was totally pulling for TCU and I was excited to see them. And I do I do like Wisconsin, though. But lost by the end of the field goal. Or by that missed field goal earlier in the game. Uh, but off of that game, let's focus on the game at hand. We got Choklahoma. <laughs> and UConn, not exactly the high-powered uh, bowl game we've seen in recent years from the Fiesta Bowl. Oklahoma, huge powerhouse, struggled last year, coming back behind Murray, who you see <laughs> scampering for a touchdown right there. And then uh, UConn, the winner of the Big East, who is an AQ just because, well, I guess when West Virginia and Pittsburgh were good, but... um really hurting which goes back to the TCU thing that's why TCU TCU's going to the Big East and the Big East chose P TCU because they both need each other if you don't have a team in the top I think it is 10 for two straight seasons you lose your AQ which West Virginia didn't have or Big East didn't have this year and if they didn't get it next year they would lose their automatic qualifying bid which is why they're inviting TCU in hopes that they'll make the top 10 um, next year so they can keep their AQ bid. Uh, and TCU obviously needs it because they don't want to have to fight so hard to get into a BCS Bowl. They want to just be able to win their conference and know they're going to a BCS Bowl because pretty much, no offense to the Big East, but it's pretty much going to be TCU, West Virginia, and Pittsburgh for may at least the next couple years. There are some teams... Uh, up there that are making some strides, no doubt. But uh, I think at least in the next two years, it's pretty much gonna be West Virginia and West Virginia and TCU. And I mean, I guess UConn came out of nowhere this year, so maybe they'll start being a powerhouse. But it sucks because most games, if you guys watch my commentaries, and this is short, so I gotta talk really fast. But uh, I'm usually like, oh, it's gonna be tough. It's gonna be close. This one, I I had a feeling was gonna be a blowout. I mean, it is Oklahoma, it's Oklahoma. It's choked a lot in the, especially the fiesta bowl but uh i i had a feeling f this was probably the worst team they have faced in a bowl game in the recent years and the coming from an anti bsu fan that's saying something and i had a feeling they're pretty much gonna walk over uconn which is why i personally chose to be uconn because i wanted this game to be kind of close and fun for me to play but i i know it doesn't count now for my predictions because i'm <laughs> saying this is what I thought the game was going to be like after the game was played, but that was just my opinion. But I do like UConn. Uh, sorry about the women's basketball team. Just all, all around a bad week for UConn, I guess. But uh, I, I do like UConn. You know, party schools stay united. But uh <laughs> just want to let you guys know I have a new blog. There's going to be a slide at the end of this telling you guys the website. It is hard hits wit Hammond at blog blogger or blogspot com. I also have a link in the description. You guys should definitely check it out because you're my fans. That's why I put this out here. Just a quick little update for you guys. Um, it's going to be because I'm going back to school. So my next video will be explaining a contest. I saw a lot of people want a contest. Uh, so I'll be doing a contest again here soon. And then you just kind of put this guy this video out to let you guys know that you should join or start joining and sub subscribing to my blog spot because I'm about to go back to school which means the videos are going to cut down in numbers again and a blog's way easier to keep up to date so you guys can still get some Lax Rocks Topher maybe not videos but I mean it'll pretty much be this just over some words so this is Lax Rocks Topher there's your slide do those four things for me and I'll love you forever this is Lax Rocks Topher keep gaming